this is the entire smart contract for oil and gas industry so we have our owner we have our state variables we have the mapping we have this two event this is the constructor we have this is the first function for create will change operator update productions and check will so this is pretty simple let's deploy the contract and let's have a look so this is the contract we are deploying click on this tip transaction went through and here you will have the instant of the contract so you'll open it if you click here you will get the honor and here you have to pass the whale so let's see where it's coming from so here we have the mapping if you pass the name of the whale you will have the data of that but we have to create a whale so to create that all we have to do is to call this function so this is the function we have create oil whale and that's what we're going to call it open this one and that we have to pass the name so we have to pass let's say dollar and if i make a transaction the transaction went through and if i pass the same name i can easily able to get the information about this particular whale so this is the information this is the address and this is the production capacity and this is the production capacity for this particular whale which is initially set to zero you have option that you can simply take a variable that what is the capacity for that particular whale and you can update it but we have this function which allow you to update this so that's a pretty simple one so it's also working fine now let's check this function so this is the function we have called change operator so which one we have is this one this is the function we have in that we have to fill out all of these data so we have to pull out the name and we have to pass the address of the new operator and the best part of this function is that that only owner the one who's created the whale can allow so if i come here um this is the first account i can simply take that one and i will go back to the the first account and here i'm going to assign the new operator to my account number two if i make the call here you can see the transaction went through and if i come here the transaction went through and now i have the permission to update and check the data okay so if i call this one this is the check will we have if i pass the name in that let's say dollar and if i click on this everything is working fine so you can see everything is working fine if you want to update like this is the function we have for change operator we have already used this is the function we have for update production so here we have the function and that we have to pass the name so i'll pass dollar and here we have to pass the amount of the production we want to increase so i'll go with five <clears throat> if i five i make a call transaction the transaction failed because right now i'm calling this function with the account number one but right now the owner of this whale is account number two so if i want to really provide that i have to switch my account so here i've come to my second account and now if i make a transaction the transaction went through because the second address is the account so this is how you can write the smart contract for oil and gas industry there is tons of things which you can include a lot of information you can take okay so i hope you guys have got the general idea that what are the function a smart contract need to have if it's dealing in the oil and gas industry okay so hope you guys have liked this video you can utilize this contract to build any one of your project in web3 space so you can take more data about the particular whale you can connect with the front end and you can design a beautiful front end where you can store the information where you allow user to register information about their will okay so this is going to be a good project for you if you really want to start with this web3 development okay so with that i'm ending this video is to if you have still any confusion any doubt do let me know in the comment section i'll try to cover that with that have a wonderful day